Hey daughter, welcome to my sweet assistant friend. To this slave where destiny is what you come from. Never a bar friend or trader come and look upon my heart. I wait for you to come to say just call your neck to come. What a grand innocence. <laughs> okay, we're gonna start playing through Morrowind. In dedication to our small one. Yes, to it is. He's never one. played an Elder Scrolls game, so that's it's half the so reason. It's so sad. It's half the reason I wanted to upload something for so long. You wanna watch this? We can. I mean, she I'm needs sure. to see it. I thought it was her talks. I don't like just sitting in silence, even if we just have to read it, it's boring. They have taken you from the Imperial City's prison. First by carriage, and now by boat. To the east, to Morrowind. Fear not, for I am watchful. You have been chosen. I like how when she says fear not, you see a cliff race. Wake up. <laughs> We're here. Why are you shaking? Are you okay? Wake up. Oh, it depresses Stand me so up. much when you hear his there you voice. Go. You were dreaming. I'm still upset I couldn't name? find him in my last playthrough. Alright, so... Do you have subtitles turned on? Yes. Okay, okay he's so... He's an Argonian. We need Argonian name. I'm oh, go get up. Alright, go. Actually, could it be, um... Because doing a small one, uh... Can we uh, do a variation of a name that sounds like Marcus? Because we kind of know a character that's terrified of wizards, and his name is Marcus. It's spelled M A R Q I S. <laughs> no, one of these Argonian names is Guy with four E's. I think we need that one. No. Please. I oh. How does that smell? Guy. No, I like Geek! No. Come on! No. We have a Khajiit named Lemon on one profile, yet Geek that is, is too bad. So? Nell off is in this game. Your logic makes no sense. He's Junal Guy. Fine. Type it in then. Alright. Junal. But you do have subtitles turned yeah. on so that I, when yes. I speak, well, they still read Not even last night's storm could wake okay, you. Okay, good. I heard them say we've reached Morrowind. I'm sure they'll let us go. Oh, the wonderful walk cycle. <laughs> He's so confident. Quiet. So here comes the guard. Why this is where you on the get ship? off? Come with me. Sure. Does he just welcome every prisoner into Morrowind? <laughs> How ironic that he later becomes the prisoner himself. That's sad. Vivek did not help him. Vivek went silent. And don't say it isn't Vivek's fault. I mean, St. Jude could have been put into a um, black soul gym way before Get Vivek was stolen by Daedra or just went missing, I don't know. Yeah. So, I think we should try to keep spoilers for the main plot line. This is where they want you. Get down to the well, that's dock, way you know, after office. the ending of this game. I know, I'm just saying. Oh, we have a visitor. My dog just ran inside. Yes. You finally arrived, but our records don't show um, from where. You keep going. I'm gonna okay. attend to the stall. Okay. Alright, so we are going to be in our going in. Oh, it's so cute! Yeah, do they have, oh, yeah, do they have blue? I don't know. Have you seen um, the mystical blue Argonians in this? They make me feel like I'm watching an 80s um, part. We are immune to poison. To poison. Really? And we yes. couldn't breathe underwater still, right? That uh, logic still for 120 true. seconds. Oh, so... Um, keep her away from the computer. I am. Computer. I am. If ah. she messes it up, I am going to The dog is sitting on the bed. She was Look excited because she heard... She heard Haru's voice. Did you hear Haru's voice? Look at the ears. It looks I... like my chihuahua's ears. Yes, I know. Ah! Oh, okay. I. Oh my gosh, it looks like a bat. With that face. It does. Okay, one of those faces. Hit this. I, like I told this. you the Argonians would be really cute to play as. This is actually the first Argonian I've ever played. Oh, I've wanted to play one for a while on Morrowind. Oh, this actually works well. He gets a 15 point bonus to athletics, a 5 point bonus to illusion. I don't be using much mysticism. He gets 5 point bonus to unarmored, and I was going to go with unarmored. 
Okay. Great. I'm sure you'll fit right in. Follow me up to the office and they'll finish it's your It's male, right? Yes. Okay. Of course, I, I mean, I played a male Altmer on here and I got whistled at quite a few times. So, I guess oh. it's whatever floats their boat. Yeah. Sakakius or Gala? Uh, yes, we've been expecting you. <laughs> uh, you'll have to be recorded before you're officially released. There are a few ways we can do this, and the choice is Yeah, his yours. voice sounds like someone's plucking a banjo. Uh, create custom class. I'm just oh, gonna can I it. write the description for this? Like, you name it, I want to write the description. I'm going to go wizard. Fat wizard, or lizard wizard. <gasps> lizard wizard! Name that as class. Go back up and name that. Oh. He is the lizard wizard. Oh, Lizard Wizard. Mm -hmm. Alright, specializations in magic. I can find having a hard time seeing the text from back here. We have the computer projected up onto my television. Yeah, the text is really small. Well, um, I'm sorry, but... Well, I then think... look down here. Look onto the computer screen. Alright, hang on. I'm thinking we should go... I'm leaving all this up to you because I'm not I'm not very savvy build. on builds. Okay, so major skills. Um What kind of weapon skill are we gonna go with? Is he long blade or short blade? I was thinking I don't know if I do want a weapon skill. Well, I mean just in case. I always Blood like weapon actually. Yeah. Stabs. So just... It's more true to the hero. It's more true to the Okay. Hero. Okay. Um, just something that we can fall back on in case we need to. Destruction. Conjuration. Inner battle mage. Alteration. Restoration. Um. Let's see here. Uh. Try not to take awful too long. I know. You gotta wonder. Well, I mean, we all know the game just pauses when this happens. Nothing's happening. But yeah. still, it's just looking at you over that little box. I thought this would be a last major skill. Kind of looks like Haskell from Oblivion. Kind of. So I understand that I can't... I can't spoil anything while we play this, I fully mm -hmm. understand. But for every time something horrible happens, can I curse at Vivek? I want to teach Small One that. Sure. That everything that horrible that happens, anytime, any place, is this Vivek's is fault. Is and this every time something fault. weird happens, well, it's like Shiagora's it. fault. Okay, so... Are you getting through? Yeah. I mean, I'm just here playing on my Kindle while you go through Okay. This. Last description. Do you want to type it in? Are you going to allow me to type it in? Yes, even though I'm scared of what you're going to say. Okay, right, give me the keyboard. Take the keyboard. Oh, crap. I got to lay it down on the... Uh... Am I spelling this right? That excels in magic. He has that excels in magic. Keep going. I'm gonna I'm gonna be using this from now on. So I can oh, you're just see. gonna hold the yeah, computer so I can on. Actually, you. see. Hold on. I gotta just the cord. So I have read it off for me as I type it. The beautiful bat lizard that excels in magic. Um, give me a minute. Has many bitches. Um, hold on. That's for, uh, that's for small one. Um, okay. Oh, if it's for small one, then. Okay, I think that's good. No, no okay. spell issue? No spelling issues? No. 
All right. All right, I'm unplugging that keyboard. Oh, you're just gonna use that? Yes. All right, we'll leave that right there in case I need to fight. All right. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, so your skills. Okay. I mean, um, trusting. Very you. good. The letter that preceded you mentioned you were born under a certain sign. Nah, it's like a nutcracker. And what would that be? What sign? Um. What's the insignia right there on that? It's the mage. It's the mage. No, no, no. On the post there. This? I'm yeah. not sure. Um. Fortify maximum magicka by 0.5% times. I'm leaving all this to you because you chose what the um, attributes are. So I'm uh, thinking. Also, people that are wondering what that moose sound is. He has a bit of a cold, so <laughs> please pardon. It's me. not really a cold. It's just the fact that I've, that like I've been congested for days and 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 days. It's only with the apprentice. Interesting. What does that? Now, before I stamp these papers, make sure this information um, is correct. Good boost to magicka. But also a weakness to Magica. Okay, I guess. Yep. Well, you start with 125 Magica, not bad. Oh, okay. What spells do we start with? Here we go. Uh, um, water breathing, fire bite. Now, is fire bite one touch? Or... Yes. Oh, come on. Touch spells are actually going to be very useful to us later on. Okay, but I mean. There's nothing like Good, we start with shield. shield. Uh, adds five points to our armor rating for 30 seconds. I say on my playthrough, I'm just focusing on a lot of powerful destruction spells. I can't find any restoration spells. Uh, that... It's really annoying. You can buy them at Balmor in Balmora. I've checked. Well, I'll, I'll show you later. Show All right. papers to the captain when you exit to get your release key. Taking this. <laughs> All right. Oh, motherfucker. Continue through to the next building and talk to some of I love him. He's so pretty. He's so cute. All right, walk around. <laughs> there was a mod I intended to install. Well, too bad. It adds a companion that goes along with the main plus line. Yeah, we're fine. Maybe he doesn't... I mean, maybe that's his whole... Maybe that's one thing about him that he, uh... He really wants a friend, but no one will be his friend. I, I don't understand who wouldn't, because he's adorable, but I, there are horrible people in this world, especially a Morrowind, so... Yeah, there are a lot of horrible people in this game. So he's kind of... I don't want to hear any more complaining from anyone in the community that the Altmer are the most racist. Yeah, the Dunmer can be pretty freaking bad. I think the Dwemer were the worst, though. Oh, yeah, the Dwemer were awful. Well, maybe a close tie with the Iliads. Yeah. I'm gonna take close. the... So, this character is not really a thief by any means, but he is a little pissed at, pretty pissed at the Empire. Well, yeah, he was in prison. For no good... He was in prison for no... For something he didn't do. He was yeah. accused of assaulting an old lady. I just so, realized... he's just stealing some of their shit. I just realized they really are... Um... I really want to be an Argonian in this. So ironic, considering we're going tomorrow. Yeah. On ESO the other he day, he will be freeing a lot of his people. Argonians talk about their life on a plantation. So he's just or, stealing. What are you stealing? Just. And just stuff can that can even, be sold. Can you sell any of it, or yeah. do you need a fence because it's stolen? You don't need a fence in Morrowind. That doesn't exist. No, okay, I could Skyrim? Stealing, I could have been stealing stuff this entire time. Okay, so one of the bi biggest loads of bullshit in Skyrim, don't get me wrong, I adore Skyrim, but one of the biggest loads of bullshit in Skyrim is that if you stole something, you automatically can't sell it, even though there, even if there's no freaking way for the person you're selling it to to have any idea that it's stolen. It makes no sense. Yeah. It is such, I would say it's from ridiculous. a certain point of view, I understand it from... Oh, oh wait. Ring. Yes, yes. The um, engraved ring of healing. But from a certain point of view, that makes sense. Because, say, it's a very valuable item. Of course you can't sell it on the regular market. That would make sense in real life. Because then you would be traced. So you would need a fence. But for regular items, that is insane. Celus Gravius. Shoulder pad. 
Okay, um, so we're sorry. We're just going through the. T- if you want to, if you really want to read badly, <clears throat> pause it. <laughs> First, let me take your papers. Thank you. Yada yada yada. Um. So basically, what he's telling me is that I'm going to take this package to Bal- the city of town of Balmora to a guy named Caius Crisades. So it's a town, not a city. But you can call it whatever you want. So yeah. And yes, Caius is going septum. to be my buddy for a while in, in this game. Who's Uriel Septum? He's Patrick Stewart. Yes. Oh, where is he? he should be up where there. is that beautiful Bosmer? He's got a wall. <gasps> Sorry, stranger. My time is short, so get on with it. Fargoth is God. I kind of... I, I forgot. A lot of the voices in this are very cartoony, aren't they? Oh yeah. That really died with the with far one too. I don't recall anyone in Oblivion or Skyrim that really well Did you see that? Cicero. <laughs> Even that's not really cartoony, it's just overacting. <laughs> but I mean Cicero's cartoon. By Azuda, by Azuda, by Azuda! Okay, yeah, that's one. That's one. Yeah, that was pretty Yeah, the freaking annoying fan. Are you gonna get Armor and free lots of money from upstairs. Free armor? I mean, not armor, like clothes. Where you uh, go to him, you find his body just to Say really something or move on. Are you gonna, I mean, we get a lot of money for that. Yeah, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've got some things to settle. Also, we need to time how long each of these are. Because yeah. I can only edit some. How long have we been on? I have no idea. Uh, I really should time it next time. I'm gonna give you until you leave Balmora, but how fast can you do the whole Fargoth thing? And then possibly the murder case thing. A few minutes. The murder case, okay, then just- The longest will be waiting for Fargoth up okay. on top of the lighthouse. Well, then do the murder thing first, because you could do that. Yeah. You know, oh, do you have this one easy or do you have it on hard? Because is that guy gonna wreck us when we walk into the house? I didn't consider that. Like I said, small one, as I hope you will watch this and be soon, whenever you have the time. If you want to read what's on the screen, what they're saying, please just pause and read. Anyone who watches this, feel free to pause and read what's going on. All right. Um. He has a very totem face. He does. I'm getting. I get a discount every day now since I help Fargoth. Oh, I've never bought anything from the store. The only thing I've bought so far is just steel armor. Yeah, I'm looking for, um... Because of Skyrim, I'm naturally, like, playing the tree. Yeah, I know. I know that feel. Alright, let's go ahead and talk to Riskar if we're gonna get that quest started. <laughs> His eyes look like cat eyes. So, basically, um, Fargoth owes him a lot of money. Because he's <laughs> Fargoth. He and was... so, this Nord here wants me to uh, find where Fargoth is hiding everything. He looks like one of the characters from Scooby-Doo's um, zombie island that turns into the cats. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know the, um, the fairy yeah. guy? <laughs> that, yeah. Like... <laughs> okay, so yeah. What say you? I'm not going to finish that quest for a little bit now. Yeah, go to oh, the wait, wait, really wait, 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 oh, wait, 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 Hang on. Do you, you saw a staff? Yes, a our, silver staff. Our staff's actually really, really, really good. Well, it's good for the role play. I mean, no offense to people that use staffs a lot in Elder Scrolls games. I've only gotten use out of them on ESO. In Skyrim and Oblivion. Well, Oblivion. Well, I get a little staffs in this are not are not like they are in Oblivion. In I Skyrim. Do, They're I, literally just bashing weapons. I've used I've used it more in Oblivion than Skyrim because I I've never actually used a staff in Oblivion. Um, in Oblivion, it's easier because I naturally the hotkeys are really easy to use, so I can switch back and forth with my blades and my staff. But yes. plus, it just it feels so nice when you make your own staff <laughs> in the Mage's Guild. It felt really special to me. So yes, I used it. All right, so charging it's horrible though. I'm gonna throw a spell at this. 
Master Quad. They really are the joke of every Elder Scrolls game, except for ESO. If you attack a mud crab in ESO, as soon as you start, it's terrifying. I I've never seen mud crabs fight back in the way they do. Are you incredible? Come on! Finally! Whoa! What's that spell? It's the ancestral ghost. Oh! Oh, I came with a spell. See? Aww. Hi. He looks all. Oh, he's giving. What's his stance? Like, look back at him. <laughs> he looks like he just really wants a hug from you. Yeah. Oh, you need to go further. He's not yeah, I drops. remember now. Um, you're gonna run into a worm thing, I think. A quantum forager. Yes. They're really annoying, make weird yes. sounds. Yeah. Yeah. I hate them. <laughs> These feel more mud crabish to me, in the sense that I'm they don't do a lot of damage, but the music really picks up when you walk by them. Yeah, okay, so if you're not familiar with. <gasps> Scrib. Oh, it's doing the little thing. Um, if you're not familiar with Morrowind, you're probably wondering why some of, a lot of my attacks weren't hitting. Um. In Morrowind, everything is done based on invisible dice rolls, much like D Dungeons and Dragons or other role-playing games of the time. Oh, you the can time. Roll. Yes. I've so, never um, done it. So, in other words, when you attack something, it doesn't de it doesn't depend on whether or not you're up to the enemy. Really, it's more about are you in range and what's the dice roll. I don't know the exact math math calculation for the dice roll. But basically, it takes into account your skill with that particular type of weapon, as well as some of your stats, and calculates whether or not you hit. Any time. Uh, it's kind. It's there's a popular mod that just that gets rid of that system altogether, makes it like Skyrim Oblivion. Um, is that glitched or is it actually that way? Look what? There. What? Oh, okay. It's just how the effect is shining. On Water. It looks like he was staring off. Go ahead, stranger. No, yeah, it's just a reflection of the water. I think the water in this game is really pretty. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was a I've got to go back to Sarkakia Sargala. Oh no, it's very nice. Alright. Yeah, this thing's really fast, you know, right? Oh yeah, it's really easy. Just some, it's easy early game. Are work. you gonna be okay with this? My spells, I should be. I mean, I killed him from a quickly dagger, but I mean. So we're going to give him the 200 septums. And then and you get more going... in return, right? I mean, you get 500. Yes. I and think. so if I find the murderer and then kill him, I will get 500 septums. Yeah. Which what? is a nice little sum for the early game. What difficulty are you playing on? I'm not sure what I have the difficulty to set on. I don't really care. Well, that might be rather critical to know. Alright. So. No? Oh. I'm gonna ask Fargoth about the murder. Oh, you gonna check? It's about in the middle. Okay. Hi, Fargoth. Why are you... So, oh, you I've gotta go talk to the lady street. in the lighthouse, but I think I forgot to get the ring off of his body. Oh, yeah, you need that. Well, it's not necessary. No, no, no. You don't get it off his body. You get it off the murderer's body. That's right. Gosh, it's been so long since I've done this quest. You're sad you don't have water I have a lot of water walking. I do have water walking. You do? Yes. Oh, it's beautiful. No. So you're going to be an Argonian that doesn't swim. Huh. I think that should be the <clears> thing. <throat> um... Yep, talk to her. This is, uh, his lover, I Yes, guess. the murder guy's lover. I mean, it is implied that they're sweethearts, right? No, it's pretty- they were in love. They were lovers. Oh. Okay. So... Oh my gosh, everyone in this has a cat face in a way. <laughs> now I've got to find the ring. The journal has been updated. 
So, did you mention the guy's name? Yeah. I don't know. Yep, Foreign Gilna. No. Um, he's in one of the little shacks. I, I think it's the but one far right. Before I. Yeah, you better save before you. No, what I really need to do is find a place to rest. Oh, is all your magic gone? Yes. Yeah, you better go rest somewhere. Uh, Only rest an hour, though, because... Does... Is it in the warehouse? Are there beds in the warehouse? I think there's a bed wall, was not there? Yeah, I think there is, but I might get in trouble. It's open, it's not open. Is it open? Or is it open? I don't know. I'll go check. I'll go check. I think everything in there is kind of a freebie, right? Yeah, it's definitely. Possibly. We're gonna save just in case. What are you gonna name it? Fat. Fat lizard. Fat lizard. Fat lizard. I'm not as energetic as I should be because I'm so congested. I'm a bit stuffed up too. Stupid fall. I mean, I love fall, but. <sighs> That just, we're in the point where do we keep the air conditioner on or do we turn it off? Okay, that one hour barely did anything. Oh, oh yeah. If your magic is down, oh yeah. Okay, you might as well just go to park off. Yeah. It's probably the middle of the night now. Well, do we have to watch him in order to trigger him? Yes, we need to watch him. That does trigger it, for sure. <laughs> yes. This is a wondrous encounter. Oh, he's right there. I know, we've got to get to the top of the lighthouse and watch him. Run! Run, bat lizard! Yeah. Then we can go take care of Foreign Gilneth. And once we kill Foreign Gilneth, we can actually start using um his house as a sort of base of operations. Oh, yeah. I never do, but... There, see... <laughs> All right, There's I see the him. little fetcher. I see him. <laughs> this sneaky animation. It, it makes me think of the Hobbit for some reason. Uh, I don't know, a really weird cartoon Hobbit. <laughs> Why does Torch go out? I don't know. Well, I mean, it's training, but that never seemed to bother it before, and then yeah. it does the game. You just gotta watch, see what Barkoff is, is gonna do. Oh, he's right yep. there. Okay. Barkoff is... is like the biggest, one of the probably the biggest meme of the game, aside from Cliff Racers and Dagoff. Dagoff, we did try to report Oblivion once, and we made Dagoff Junior. I don't know if you remember that or not. Yes. He was beautiful. It didn't work out very well. Yeah, my computer crashed. I think your computer had issues. It's because I was using XSplit. Uh, which takes up a lot of CPU. Yeah. So it screws up game recording. Really obnoxious. Alright, we need to do this and probably it's more as Of course, I don't know how. I'll take out Foreign Gilner first. Alright. We'll just take care of, finish everything up here in Satanine. Oh, yeah, I think we can start it. Then next time, we can take care of. We can. We can We'll head to Balmora. We'll probably stop in Mom. Pull AD out on the way. What are you talking about? You take the strider. I'd rather walk. You're gonna walk? Yeah. But there's a giant bug vessel. We need to show Small One the giant. We need to show her that. I like the walk to Balmora. All right, but before you walk, you gotta show her it. Like just walk up to right. her sides. This isn't just for her, you know, this is for all the people. I know, I know, but also, there could be other people that don't know what they are. The Silt Striders. Yes, even I though, found Fargoth's hiding place. Even though how you control them is really. Why'd you go back to it? You just kept the gold. Because I'm being assistant to his character. Hey, oh, yeah, the Argonians are pretty No, he just has morals. <laughs> <laughs> so does my Dunmer. Kinda. All right, so now it's time to go take care of Gilmer. I'm just gonna do this. It's not this. It's not this. It's the one on the far right. Right? Save. Yep, there it is. All right, so you should really save before going in there. Yes, I know I should save. 
Bat lizard! Bat lizard! So we are going to kill him. Alright, go murder. Go murder. And if you die, it's with that skull. You don't have any mods that show these graphics. No. Um, do I don't know, they all look everything looks a bit more clear than it does on mine. Yeah, uh, it of could course, be the uh I've seen this twice. Oh, yeah. I see it. I hear on my fleet to back to the Wow, you're losing no health. I'm losing stamina. Which is not fun. I've never seen a battle with this. Come on. You failed. You're, you're out of Magicka. No, I'm not. You aren't? No. Stop failing the spell! See? That's what happens. Get out the staff. Yeah, now I've out- now I've- Get out the staff. I'm trying! The back why? All his fault. Everything. See, he's just knocking out my- he's knocked out my stamina. Do you have any stamina potions? No. Well, if he kills us, <laughs> we reload and we'll focus some stamina potions. You will die. I'm gonna try to get out, actually. He won't follow you. No. I don't think he'll let you. Alright, we're just gonna rest here for a second. Oh, hello! Yeah, Did we're you completely just try out of stamina. Murder, so no, that, that has no magical attributes to it, the staff? No. It's just the staff that you hit yeah. people with? Yeah. I can't wait. Are you gonna use spears with this character? Or no. no. Oh. Can you at least, like, pick one up so I can see it? Yeah, sure. I haven't used a spear yet. And I want other people to experience spears. Should be ready. At, you know, after this game, you never get to see it again. Yeah, he doesn't have this There we go. There we I go. I want nice a spear. Right. I want to be able to do Vlad the Impaler right in Skyrim. I mean, they're not impalement rods, but it's close. Alright. Now we need to report his... Let's go yeah. talk oh, to the yeah. guys. Go, give, roll. Give, go oh, yeah. give her the ring first. Yes. And then you can just save inside his house. Yeah. After well, I gotta you... go talk to I know, the... after you finish everything, just go back to the house and save there. Yeah. Alright. Gosh. Hey, I got the ring. Stupid mother. She gave me two standard restore health potions. For that. Wow. We could have used those one day. Or, you know. Hmm. Nah, those that's that's help on skin. He was kicking our scaly tail. I dread because we want to do the mages guild. I really dread running across that bridge. <laughs> I'm gonna be up at night terrified of that. That, re that really is gonna like take our. That guy's gonna take our health really fast. You'll see what we mean in the future. Yeah, well, we can hold off on that. Unless we do what you did with my dash. But... Or. Uh, I don't know if you can just levitate to get around him. Alright, we're just gonna go back to the guy's house that we just killed. Do you hear the loud moon in the distance? For yes. those that don't know what it is, like, be really quiet. That moan, that's the, uh, Silk Strider. Yes. Oh, that was, it was so, I remember when I first heard that on the Dragonborn DLC on Skyrim. I was in love. Like this? Really so, messed up how you control them, though. This house is now essentially ours. Yeah. Uh, we can All store anything stuff. we want. We can rest in his hammock. It's really creepy. I mean, it's a great place, but there's a dead body still inside. Oh, just very close. You can do that? Yes. All right. That's beautiful. All right. Thank no you one for watching. Ever I know. Thank you for watching. Bye. Now you know how to get rid of bodies.